Yeah, hi, welcome to today's video. In today's video, we're gonna be looking and talking about Pinterest keyword research, okay? So we're gonna find three different ways that you can simply go and check out where you can find the best keywords for your Pinterest account so that your pins would have a better chance of going viral. So without further ado, let's jump across and we'll start going through Pinterest keyword research. Okay, so we've come on to my Pinterest account and we're going to be uh, showing you three different easy methods you can use to go and get Pinterest key and to go and do your Pinterest keyword researches. So you want to get the best keywords possible uh, for your pins so that you can get your pins in front of as many people as possible. So the first one we're going to do, very, very simple. Uh, we're just going to come across from our account. We're going to go up to here and we're going to click on the search icon here. And we're going to make sure that this says all pins here. And we're going to then just start actually typing. OK, so for argument's sake, if I wanted to find um, things to do with dogs, I'd start typing in. And I've got dog here. Now, as you can see straight away, I've got some search um, terms that have come up. Dog tattoo. Dog memes, a dog treats, homemade, dog tattoo ideas, dog quotes, dog drawing, dog breeds, dog birthday cake. So as you can see, loads of different ideas straight away. Now you want to look at possibly um, terms that are going to be maybe two, maybe possibly three keywords long. So dog treats, homemade, dog tattoo ideas, dog birthday cake are really good uh, targeted keywords that you could use to obviously go and create a pin about, okay? So that is the first way that you can actually go and do this. So if we were to click uh, dog treats homemade, so this obviously starts bringing up all the, the top uh, ranking, uh, obviously, uh, pins that are actually for dog treats homemade. Now, check out, uh, what you can do is obviously check out what they are actually posting about which are what are on their pins so this one's got homemade dog treats actually on the pin that's got dog treats written on it this has got dog treats okay uh, this one's got dog biscuits so that's a bit different um, as you scroll down again you'll get other things dog treats here okay dog treats there so as you can see they've got dog treats within the actual image so that just shows you that you're going to need to probably have dog treats in the image the actual wording and obviously then your pictures of dog treats etc so check out uh, obviously what other people are using because this will also give you different keywords that you could actually rank for as well now the second way you can obviously uh, get different keywords for pinterest is if you carry on scrolling down you keep scrolling it goes all the way down I'm quite a way down into the searches here and as you can see on the left hand side here now this can pop, pop this can pop up anywhere on the page but it's on the left hand side today and as you can see we've got more keyword ideas because it's 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 pointing you towards these other topics that could be of interest. Easy DIY dog treats, simple dog treats, handmade dog treats, baked dog treat recipes, easy dog treat recipes. So as you can see, this is the second place to obviously look. So every so often you will get what they call related searches, okay? So that is the number two place where you can go and check out to get more Pinterest keywords for your pins. Now the final one, uh, we want to go across to analytics and we want to click on trends. And again, we can do exactly the same. It says your top trends on Pinterest this week in the United Kingdom. But if you're not, even though you are in the United Kingdom, you could search the US, Canada or the UK. So if I just wanted the UK for argument's sake, and if I wanted again to put in maybe dog treats I'll put dog treat ideas and as you can see this is it again it's come up dog tattoo ideas well this is actually going up in a trend at the moment uh, dog room ideas dog grooming salon ideas uh, so again that's a bit up and down this one here uh, dog 
tattoo ideas memorial so it looks like uh, t dog tattoos is really big at the moment um dog crate ideas dog kennel outdoors as you can see loads of different uh, keywords it's bringing up again that you could then go into further and what you want to try and do is get something all of these keywords is make sure there's a high volume of actually searches per month uh, because obviously there's no point in obviously making a pin that's only getting that people are only actually uh, looking at sort of five or six a day uh, you want something that's going to get a hundred views a day because you've got a better chance then of people obviously clicking through on your pin these three ideas that you can use for your pinterest keyword research okay I trust you found that useful and interesting if you did smash up the like button for us don't forget to watch these videos next and if you haven't already make sure you subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell and you'll get notified every time we make a new video that's it for today we'll see you on the next video